Holly, Chris McGarrian today. And well, duh. She told Chris that all those responsible for the effort to overturn the results of the 2020 presidential election and the ensuing violence uh, must be held accountable, even if that, okay. that means uh, former President Trump. In short, does the president agree with those sentiments? So let me just step back for a second. And just try to go beyond or past uh, the uh, the headlines for a moment because I think it's really important. Uh, you'll see that the president uh, get out of here. Uh, the, the, that the um, uh, that the vice president uh, vice president Harris spoke very clearly about how everyone is entitled. Everyone is entitled to their rights, uh, but that everyone uh, has to follow the rules as well. So. Man, that sucks. As you know, she is a former prosecutor. She knows that very well. Uh, and understands that she was affirming, uh, certainly affirming, oh affirming her belief in our system of laws, which is a f something that, of course, the president uh, shares and believes in. Uh, not going to go beyond that. I think her remarks were very clear. If you go beyond, that doesn't make sense. Uh, certainly beyond the headlines. And so again, she was re uh, reaffirming or affirming her belief in our system. Again, this is something that, of course, the president believes in, and we're going to uh, be continue to be uh, very mindful. I'm going to continue to be very mindful here and I'm going to let the Department of Justice ah. uh, do uh, do their job independently and so I'm just going to leave it there. Oh, God.